Good day to you people of the interwebs, and welcome to this week's edition of Transformer of the Week. Well, I'm going to be looking at this guy. This is Generations Scourge. Now, uh, Generations Scourge is a fine-looking um, s stealth spy jet turned space boomerang. <laughs> Comes back to you all the time. Um, yeah, he's a fine-looking jet thing. Um, I don't know what's particularly stealthy about it. it you know, can glide below radar, and it's kind of uh, looks like um, it's very cloud coloured and sky coloured. Can get away with it maybe in a nice sunny day. A little wisp of cloud just going over here. Um, but yeah, he's got uh, some nice details on here. Um, it's got the landing gear, but uh, it's a bit shit. <laughs> Never mind, then we can pull them away. <laughs> You don't need them. They're not actual wheels, and they're kind of moulded on the, the wrong side, so they don't look. They're not facing outwards, so that's just a bit weird. Um, Pegs are very, very nice. Uh, he's got one of those cool things because he's a scourge. You can kind of pull his robot head out a little bit, so he can say, "Hello." You know, that's a thing scourge does, uh, especially when he was the. Uh, flying shoe thing that he was in the 1986 movie. It's the 20th anniversary of the 1986 30th anniversary. <laughs> Even, oh, feeling oh, 30th anniversary of the 1986 Transformers the movie. And this was a guy in it. Back when I was a kid. And we'll get to this later. Um, he's a Transformer. He transforms. Funny old game. <laughs> it's funny old game. So, um, basically, you flip these back. It's a fun transformation. He's got a lot. There's a lot of fun things going on with this figure. Let me tell you. Um, I just like how they've kind of just got everything going on here. So these legs kind of come out here. So the cockpit makes the legs. Uh, yeah. Come on, come on, sketch. Back here, his wings flap up and round and back. Like I said, the head pulls out. So we're getting there, we're getting there. And then these bits flip up. very interesting kind of arm transformation where you flip that round, spin that round onto like that. And then the hands pop out. I mean look at that. So from that to a fully fledged arm like that, that's magic baby. That is just absolute transforming wizardry. How good is that? That is just absolutely excellent, and they've just, you know, they've nailed this head sculpt. Like I say, when I was a kid, I thought transforming Transformers with facial hair was a bit stupid. Now, as an adult, <laughs> I enjoy uh, transforming Transformers with facial hair. I wish this would peg in. A bit better, but it, you know, it's all right. I like this backpack. I like a winged backpack. It's uh, that's not kibble. That's just wings, you, and it's not just wings. You see, at the moment, he doesn't have any weapons. That's because his weapon storage is in its wings. In the wings, Fred. Weapon storage 
It's in the wings. <laughs> oh. Oh, a dick. Oh. So, we open that up and we can see in the, the actual cavity is perfectly shaped for this pistol here. God, I love classics. Transforming class, you know, the classics line is just absolutely just fantastic. This is good transformers. So you can have his pistol like that, and then in the other wing, they have this double barrel effigy, so you can flip out a handle like this. So he can dual wield um, his guns, but because it operates on the clip system, get at it. You can actually use this clip on here and clip it on top of there, so it resembles his, his target master gun, Fracker. So I think that is absolutely excellent. And let me tell you just about this. It's just it's got a very emotive ball joint on the head. Um, I don't know if we're picking up the light pipe in here as well, but it's got some decent enough light piping. Not as good as Cyclonus's, but decent enough light piping. Um, he's got all kinds of just different movements on his shoulder. His leg falls off when you're making it, putting it on a film, but uh, it's no harm, no foul. It's ball joints, that's what they do. So, we put that on there. So he's got all this just loads of different movements, biceps and things and wrists and elbows, just everything you want, everything you want in there, um, waist swivels, thigh swivels, ball jointed legs, double jointed knees, ball jointed foot, this guy is poseable, you know what I mean, this guy has got <sighs> so much going on, and I like how they've committed to the reddish hands, I would have preferred it if gone pink, you know, if they would have just fully committed to the pink for his fingers, but other than that, yeah. It's just very dynamic. He's this, you can move these wings in different ways, you know, to have a float ship bow. Oh, he's gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Now, he is going to be, um, there's going to be, a, I think it's a premium set or whatever, platinum gift set of, um, Cyclonus, Scourge, and a sweep. So it's going to be him with, with a different head sculpt. So there's going to be two of him, one of them with a different head sculpt, and a Cyclonus. There's going to be lots of translucent plastic in the set, but you know, I know a lot of people get put off by translucent plastic, but you know what? I, 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 nah. It kind of nice. It's kind of I think it's kind of pretty when lights hit translucent plastic. Yeah, it, supposedly it's a bit more fragile, but I'm not throwing the Transformers against brick walls or anything like that. I'm not, you know, aggressively playing with them. I'm not saying I'm not playing with them, but I'm not aggressively playing with them. So, for me, if it's a little bit more brittle, I, uh, yeah, give it a shite. Not me, sir. But all in all, this is just a fantastic Transformer. This is, you know, really nice bit of kit you can get in your set if you want to get transformers and things. He's a movie character, so you know all power to him. And he's one of those characters that, you know, if you wanted to get like a shit ton of these, you could get a shit ton of these and it would look great together. Because, you know, Scourge comes with his huntsman, the sweeps. Oh gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Just just the shape of it, the style of it, the proportions, the gun, the posability. This is good Transformer, the, the legacy character. So, worth getting hold of. Worth finding, worth getting hold of. Or picking up that, um, coming up set, uh, platinum gift set, if you can find it. But yeah, anyway, that is Scourge. That is my Transformer of the week. Um, join me next week when there'll be more Transformers and more weeks and more things going on. I, I was like saying the other week, I was saying like, oh, I reckon this would be the, like, the last year of Transformer of the week because, you know, 
I'll probably run out of Transformers at some point. And then you're just kind of just like wandering around your house or something going, oh, I've not done a video on him yet, I've not done a video on him yet, I've not done... And it's like, mm, maybe, maybe I've got more than a year's worth. <laughs> then, you know, might actually buy new Transformers. Who knows? Titans return! Skull fucker! Yes! Be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes, and because you deserve it, Fisto! Fisto!